Teen Recovery Solutions offers recovering teens battling addictions, positive activities after school and on weekends. Peer recovery coaches spoke with the Oklahoman's Brian Painter about what they have to offer students. So many times addiction takes away a person's life, takes away their family, takes away their future. We're trying to give them a future without the use of drugs and alcohol, to regain those family relationships, to regain their education, um, to regain that hope um, that there is a future to look forward to. And when they come in here and they, they find value in themselves, their self-esteem and self-worth, when it starts to go up, um, it's amazing what they do, how they feel about themselves, what they can accomplish. The group was formerly known as Oklahoma Outreach Foundation. It includes its Mission Academy High School and the Peer Alternative Group. The private recovery high school helps teens recover from drug and alcohol addictions while allowing them to finish high school. It is an aftercare component in which the student can learn through web-based classes rather than going back to their previous school setting. While students of the academy are required to participate in the alternative peer group, the program is also open to students of other Oklahoma City metro area schools who are battling addictions. It really incorporates positive peer involvement um, along with a commitment from families. I always wanted to be sober and I love that there's a bunch of teenagers that don't want to be and I know that if they're here then something in them wants it and um, that's that's the biggest thing that reminds them so much of me because I always wanted it I just didn't know how to want it. Panda reports the program was created to address the teens social psychological and emotional issues plus it involves a lot of family participation. For example, there are sessions with the parents in which they are asked to set healthy boundaries, letting the teens know what they expect, such as being honest and following the rules of the house. Along with recovery therapy groups and parent groups offering education and counseling, there are also activities like kayaking, bowling, or rock climbing after school and on the weekends. Teaching these teens how to have a good time, how to have healthy relationships in recovery. And we do those on like Fridays and Saturdays, key times when teens can go out and make some poor choices sometimes.